Jury today heard opening statements and witness testimony in the trial of a woman accused of killing her friend with eye drops. Jesse Kershevsky faces counts of first degree intentional homicide and theft for the 2018 death of Lynn Hernan. Bruce Harrison has been in Waukesha County Court all day. Here's the latest. The jurors sat quietly with serious expressions as the state and defense made their openings. The state saying Lynn Hernan was killed. The defense that she took her own life. Seated at the defense table, Jesse Kershevsky, as the state tells jurors, she killed her family friend Lynn Hernan, motivated by greed. There's certainly a factual, bare bones timeline of theft, murder, and more theft, but there's this almost overlaid timeline of all of the defendant's lies and deceit on top. According to the criminal complaint, Kershevsky defrauded Hernan out of nearly $300,000, including money from her estate. She finally gave that water bottle, knowing it had, in the defendant's estimation, six bottles of Izine to Lynn Hernan, knowing it could kill her. Kershevsky later emotional, as the defense says Lynn Hernan was like a mother to her. And if Lynn Hernan was here today, she would say, are you crazy, prosecution? That's my daughter that you have sitting there at that desk over there. That's my daughter. The defense says Lynn Hernan knew Kershevsky was spending her money, and Hernan took her own life using alcohol and prescription medication. And she had a boatload of that in her system. And they're saying that no, the Visine kills her, not these 25 to 30 other pills that she had in her system, that she took along with the alcohol. The state also calling witnesses, including the former deputy medical examiner who pronounced Hernan dead at her home. The state will continue examining witnesses tomorrow in a trial that could last several weeks. Reporting in Waukesha, Bruce Harris and TMJ4 News. And you can watch the trial of Jesse Kershevsky live wherever you stream TMJ4 News. It's on Roku as well as the TMJ4 News app.